Well, this is the best text-to-speech or TTS model. Discover Kokoro version 0.19, the cutting-edge TTS model that's making waves in the TTS community. With only 82 billion, with only, excuse me, with only 82 million parameters, Kokoro version 0.19 it delivers remarkable performance despite its compact size. It has been trained on less than 100 hours of audio and running for under 20 epochs. And it has quickly risen to become the number one ranked TTS model in the TTS spaces arena as of making this video, which is Jan 15th, 2025. Now, in this video, we will explore the different features of Kokoro version 0.19, test its capabilities using a Google Collab notebook, and evaluate the results by ourselves. Now, this can be used for your own projects, and it's pretty good so far as I've tested. Now, Kokoro version 0.19 is fully open source, it's free, and licensed under the Apache 2.0, thereby making it a versatile and accessible options to developers and enthusiasts. So let's check it out. Now, regarding the training details, it has been trained on NVIDIA's 880 GPU VRAMs instances via vast.ai. This is another great service, vast.ai. The data set, as we have seen, it's less than 100 hours of audio and epochs is less than 20. So let's check it out on Collab. So let's go to, let's go to Google Collab. So let's open a notebook here. And if I go back to this Hugging Face repo, we can see that we have this piece of code. The following can be run in a single cell on Google Collab. Now that's pretty amazing, just a single line. So let's open up a new notebook here and I'm just going to copy this to a single cell as it says. I'm going to paste it here and I'm going to connect with the change runtime, connect with D4 GPU and save and let's click on connect here. So speaking of the code, so we have the first part where we are installing some dependencies. So LFS is a scheme for large file systems. We are cloning this repository, Hugging Face repository, changing the directory and installing a few things here. Then we are building the model. So from models, we are importing build model, we are importing torch, using the device of CUDA if it's available, else we are using CPU. Model name is this dot pth this is the latest and this is using the device so we have the model here these are the voice details so there are 10 voices we are using the zeroed voice which is the af now the default voice is 50 50 mix of bella and sarah we have this voice pack uh, which is a torch dot load and we are pushing that to the device here we are just printing the voice name that you have selected and this is the generation part so what you can do is you can just put this on a separate here and run the first part of the code so it's installing getting git lfs initialized cloning into cockro 82 million and then it's it's cloning and then it should install the things that is necessary let's look at this code so from Kokoro, we import generate, and this is the entire text that we want to change to speech because it's a TTS uh, software. Then we have started this generate. We are using this generate instance, uh, giving the model. What is the model? The model is this. This is the model, Kokoro version 0.19. We are giving the text, which is the text that we want to change to voice. We are giving the voice spec. Voice spec is again this. Uh, this is a torch module and we're giving the language of voice name of zero and here it's written that it's it's american english so next we are going to display a few things display the 24 kilohertz audio and print the output so i think this is done this is ready and we can now just run this part of the code and we should get a few things while this is running um how could i know it's an unanswerable question like asking an unborn child if they'll lead a good life they haven't even been born. 
That's pretty cool. Would you like to listen to it again? Again. How could I know? It's an unanswerable question. Like asking an unborn child if they'll lead a good life. They haven't even been born. I mean, that's pretty amazing. So let's go ahead and copy this again and put in a different thing. Okay. Let's see now. Run. And... 5.4 is a state-of-the-art open model built upon a blend of synthetic datasets, data from filtered public domain websites, and acquired academic books and Q and a datasets. The goal of this approach was to ensure that small capable models were trained with data focused on high quality and advanced reasoning. That is amazing. That is amazing. Amazing quality and it's pretty good. Now, I would like to end this video with this. Okay, let her say it and then we're going to close this video. Please subscribe to my channel. Hit that like button and comment on what you would like to see next. Oh, that's pretty great. So go ahead and test this out. It's pretty simple. You can run it on a single cell. And this is Kokoro 82 million, just 82 million parameters. And this is the best open source TTS that you can use. If you'd like to know more about 5.4 model from Microsoft, watch out the next video. Else you can go through my channel and see the other amazing videos that I create. Well, at least for myself, you can go ahead and check it out and I will see you next time.